Our FFA Chapter Tribute is brought to you by Pioneer, developing new generations of seed innovations for new generations of farmers. Pioneer, what's next happens here. And we're proud to continue meeting that next generation of agricultural leaders. This week, it's Clara Duncan. She serves as the state reporter for the Oklahoma FFA. Clara, thanks for joining us this week. Thank you so much for having me today. If you would, tell us a little bit about the ag around Chickasha, Oklahoma. So actually, um, I believe my teammate Kylie talked a little bit last week. We're both from the southwest area of the state. And so a lot of that is similar, but I do have a few cotton producers actually out around where I live. One is right down the road from me. Um, he produces cotton and peanuts and has a rotation of that. And I believe corn as well. And then we also have cattle and wheat, which is very common for the southwest area of the state. Absolutely. And of course, now you are serving in FFA leadership. And I'm curious, Clara, what was it that made you want to be a part of the FFA? So the biggest thing for me was my uncle is actually an ag teacher in Indianola, Oklahoma, and he kind of prompted me to join the FFA my freshman year, and I didn't really know how involved I was going to be, but as soon as I did my first opening and closing ceremonies contest, I knew that's where I needed to be, and I was excited to jump in and be very involved. And what sort of leadership opportunities did you have a chance to take, to take advantage of in FFA? So I was able to actually be a chapter officer for two years in high school. And so as a vice president, my junior year and my senior year, I was able to be the president. And along with that, I was able to just kind of communicate with the members of my chapter, hopefully get them involved and just encourage them to do what they can um, what, when they have the time um, in their jacket. All right. And of course, planning for the future. Clara, do you hope to uh, make agriculture your career is looking down the line? Yes, so actually I'm a freshman at Oklahoma State University right now and I'm studying agricultural communications. I'm not exactly sure what that looks like right now. I have considered ag education as well, um, but for sure having agriculture be somewhere in my career. Fantastic. Well, agriculture needs good young minds coming up. Clara, we wish you the best of luck. Thanks so much for talking with us this week. Thank you so much for having me.